we first started Top Gear, we thought it would be a really good idea, in the interests of fairness, to make sure our test track was always wet, so it was the same for all the cars we tested. Thing is, good idea, but we made a complete hash of it. All we were left with was a really big bill for a water tanker that wasn't big enough to soak the whole track. Seriously, it was just like all dry with some strategically placed deep puddles at odd corners. And that is why, in the first programme, the Lamborghini Merchilago with dead stig at the wheel set a time of one minute 29. Now, we always knew it could do better than that. So, we sent fresh stig out onto a dry track to see what the Merchilago can really do. So we're off the line. It's four-wheel drive, remember, so not much wheel spin, but once it's moving, look at it go up to the first corner. Look how flat it corners. Down towards Chicago, and it's practically level. Hard on the brakes down here, listen. Go down through the gears. That is looking fast and smooth and stable. That's a lovely bit of bar. Bless you the stick, of course, and it's the music from a cigar advert. Now down towards a hammerhead. Will it understeer? Will it egg? Absolutely. Listen to that. Oh, that's magnificent. Heading towards a follow-through, of course, now. Will he lift? Will he take it? Oh, <laughs> I don't I think slight dab on the brakes, maybe. Already well upon its previous time. Will Fresh Stig keep the pace up into the penultimate corner? Absolutely flat and level and grips astonishing through Gambon and across the line in... Well, now, this is important because the Zonda, which is our fastest car ever, is a 123.8. Which is a fantastic And the Koenig is 123.9, okay. so... it's close at the top. One minute. Twenty. Three. Three. Point. Seven. It's done it! <laughs> it's the fastest car ever! Round the top gear test track. That is amazingly fast. We always knew it would be, and I was really looking forward to the moment because, of course, you now can't put that <laughs> on there. Uh, you'd love to think so, big fella, but you're wrong because look. Oh, no, <laughs> I wondered why we were doing it in this corner today. I had a word. There you go. Look at that. The only thing faster than the Merchilago 123.7 is a jet fighter. That's a quick thing.